Yo guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm back again with Ark Survival Evolved video. Now, today we're actually going to be explaining and talking about the kill barriers and the teleportation zones. Uh, now, this video was actually requested in the comments as well um, earlier today, um, so that's why I'm making this like um, video mainly um, for you guys who don't really understand them. Um, now, first of all, a teleportation zone is basically something that what uh, both of a teleportation zone and a kill barrier is stuff that are inside of the mesh if for you guys that, that don't know um so like rocks not like breakable rocks as you can see here but like the rocks as part of the mountains so like textures like mountains and um, stuff like that that's where all the you'll find all these teleportation zones and kill barriers um now first of all i'm just going to talk about the kill barriers um the kill barriers like i say are to stop mesh so basically what it is is when you do a mesh method let's say you use sleeping bags one inside of the, um, the mesh which is inside the rock or anything on the mountain and one outside of the um, rock um, basically when you teleport to go inside of the rock what will happen is you'll instantly die um, now that's actually due to a kill barrier and like I say it's just to stop um, obviously people from meshing and stuff like that um, now you'll actually find these kill barriers in rocks like these as you can see here and um, obviously like mountains and stuff like that uh, like texturized um, uh, mountains and uh, rocks uh, where it's like people are gonna like it's gonna be like a high chance people mesh in um, now there's actually a way to stop dying through there and that's if you are actually on a team so if you are on a team where you go for the mesh and um, the kill barriers that won't affect you whatsoever if you're sat on top of a team um, but as soon as you jump off of the team you'll just instantly die um, so that's what the kill barriers do really like I said it's just to stop meshing and um, they're basically found in most zones um, now the areas where you won't find these teleportation zones or uh, kill kill areas is in mesh holes now mesh holes are like places that wild card has basically got in the game um where the textures aren't lined up so there'll be like a hole in the mountain or something like that and uh, where you can actually just walk straight through it and you'll be able to get straight into the mesh um now in these areas there's no actual kill barriers or telep teleportation zones um so basically mesh areas that don't require a method so like no teleport uh, like no teleporters no sleeping bags anything like that um, so it's basically something that's already in the map where you can just walk through and do um, something like that. So that's where these kill barriers and teleportation zones won't be into place. Um, but if you do explore the mesh, once you're inside of these mesh holes, there might be teleportation zones further along. That's if you do go out the area um, and stuff like that. Uh, but what I'm just going to talk about now is actually the teleportation zones a bit more as well. So you guys get a bit more understanding on what these are. Um, so the teleportation zones are basically areas inside of the mesh which don't have a floor um, so it's basically a mesh detection method where the um, world basically detects that you are under the under the map flying and uh, it teleports you back to the map now i'm just going to use the um, blink gun to actually get inside of here to show you guys um, so as you can see here now on the floor it's actually water and there's no like no area to actually stand on uh, now if you're actually meshed in this without using the blink gun um, obviously because I used the blink gun I won't get teleported but if you did this normally and you went into this um, went into this zone using teleporters or something like that what will happen is you would get teleported straight back to the top of the surface after like a couple of seconds now this is due to because there's no ground or place where you can actually like stand on and stuff like that um, so if you are actually floating underneath the map for a long period of time or not even a long period of time for a couple of seconds probably like five seconds and uh, there's no like floor to actually touch nearby uh, you'll actually get detected like you detected that you float underneath the map and you'll just be teleported straight above um, now if there's actually a land underneath of the what well, inside the mesh where you can actually walk on and build on um, you won't actually get teleported because there's no teleportation zone there because obviously there's a floor there where you will be standing on so it won't be classed as a any zones or anything like that uh, so you'll be completely fine with uh, them if there's actually got the floor um, but like I say if you are going through a mesh hole uh, mesh holes always have the floor as well by the way so if it's a mesh hole you won't be just sent straight into the map and um, that's why there'll be no teleportation zones or kill barriers because obviously it's like a like a uh, like a I don't know like a map underneath kind of so you can just stand on it and stuff like that. So there's a surface underneath which you can stand on basically and um, nothing will, will affect you there but if you do actually go exploring in that area um, like I say you could hit a teleportation uh, zone along the way um, this is just because obviously you are going through the map and further along the map there's going to be teleportation zones in different places to stop from different uh, mountains if that kind of makes sense um, so uh, yeah so that's that I hope you did actually understand these a bit better 
Uh, also, comment down below if you have any questions and I'll answer them and obviously help you all out. Um, but thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And like I say, drop a comment down below as well if you would like to request any uh, glitches or methods or if you do need help with any parts of the video. And um, yeah, hopefully you get more understanding than what kill barriers are now and what teleportation zones are. Um, so like mesh holes and like the um, extinction structure towers, there's no mesh barrier, there's no kill barriers or teleportation zones in them, so you'll be completely fine in them. Um, but on every map, there's always t kill zones and teleportation zones like on mountains and stuff like that inside of them. But thank you for watching.